April McLean had some pretty big odds to overcome. She revolved in and out of 22 foster homes within three years, attended 13 high schools, and got pregnant at 15. After aging out of the system at 17, she lived on the streets at one point and cleaned motels for $8 an hour. Today, as the owner of a growing business at 3579 University Avenue called Room to Dance, McLean's life is hectic by design. Watch my foot. Since opening Riverside's first adult-only studio in July 2011, enrollment has more than quadrupled to 960 dance students and increased its roster of untraditional classes. When I found out that she was opening her studio, I found out through a mutual friend, a student of mine, told me, oh, there's a woman in Riverside who's going to start an da adult dance studio doing all of the traditional dances, ballet, tap, jazz, hip-hop, etc. And I said, she's going to need me to run world dance for her. And what kind of dance do you study? All the ballrooms, um, I love contemporary and modern, jazz, almost it all except ballet. <laughs> okay. I'm not a ballet dancer. <laughs> and now is this more of us like your workout kind of exercise or workout, is this more like just time, to have fun? Both. Both. It's time, it's workout to keep me healthy also to um, give me, you know, my time. My time to center myself, to refocus and just decompress. <laughs> Through an online social networking campaign, $6,000 was raised for the second startup, renovation of the 1,000 square foot room, incorporation, insurance, and equipment for both studios. Um, their friends and family would donate, and then their friends and family would... So we were getting donations from names that we were like, who is this? We don't know who this is, but we had a lot of support. Yeah, it was awesome. Terry Pearson, this is Angel Ortiz for the Press Enterprise and PE.com.